For the community now, it's a big day here at CBS4 as we're gearing up for our annual Fill the Bus school supply drive. Join us now from the Food Bank RGV's Chief Program Officer, Libby Salinas. Good morning. Good morning. Thanks Hi, for Alka. waking up so early for thank us. You. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It's going to be a long day, but it's for a good cause. Let's just talk about those and who need this help from this program. Um, we're doing Fill the Bus to benefit school tools. Absolutely. So what is School Tools? School Tools is actually a program uh, created by the Food Bank. It helps target uh, the most underserved children that we have in the Valley. We target schools that are at 95 percent, uh, have, have at 95 percent economically disadvantaged children um, in their school districts. So teachers are able to come in once a month, they're able to shop, take back about $450 worth of products back to their classroom for those students that, are, uh, that don't have supplies and they're able to use it for the whole classroom themselves. And approximately how many supplies were distributed last year? Uh, last year we hit over $839,000 worth of products were given uh, to our schools. Wow. Wow, so that just shows the great need. That's almost a million dollars in supplies. Yes. So, of course, this year we're looking to hit that number or even higher. Let's just talk about the particular items that you need the most. You said the teachers are going to identify the children who don't come with supplies, so we're looking for several things. Correct, correct, correct. Uh, we, we really need uh, loose leaf paper, uh, Pencils, crayons, glue, uh, dry erase markers, those are things that we are looking for, uh, that we are really in need of uh, colored pencils and colored markers as well. And again, we'll be outside our studios here in Harlingen at the HEBs in Mission and in Brownsville until 6 o'clock this evening. Correct. Now, teachers want to come out. Uh, how does it work? The teachers then distribute the items, and when can they distribute the items? Correct. Uh, teachers can begin uh, shopping on uh, September 1st. Uh, those teachers that are in our, our system, we have 55 schools that we work with. They can start uh, sending emails to the school tools manager or the school tool assistant manager to start signing up for, for this year's school tools program. Perfect. All right. Well, thank you so much, Libby, for joining us. Of course, you'll be here with us for the rest of the day, yes. and we'll have staff at the Mission HEB as well, so Brownfield HEB collecting those school supplies. It makes it very convenient at HEB. You can just yes. buy the supplies there. <laughs> All right. Thank you very much, Libby. We appreciate it. Thank you.